When we look at what's happening in Ukraine at the moment, I think it is very easy to feel disempowered and to feel helpless, like there's nothing you can do. And there is something we can do. So of course, there's the practical things like sending money, sending food, sending clothing, but also at an energetic, at an emotional, at a consciousness level, there is something that we can do. So what I would suggest is that you, first of all, you look inside yourself and to notice every time you watch the news, you read something, you hear something, what is it bringing up in me? What is the emotion that I am feeling inside? And how can I work to process that and to release this? The other question you could ask is about what is the conflict inside of me that needs resolving? And the more that we can do that, the more that we can process these emotions to move them on. One definition of emotion is energy in motion. And if you know we're stuck in this terrified feeling or angry feeling, it's kind of stuck energy. And what we want to do is to either use tapping or something to move through, to help this emotion to move through you so that you are no longer holding on to it and you're no longer frozen in this state of paralysis. Because I think when we release these emotions, then we are in a better position to be spreading forth our light, to be offering out our light of peace, hope, compassion, love, kindness, so if we are doing it from a clear space ourselves, the light that we are sending out is going to be so much brighter. And I do believe in the power of prayer, the power of collective consciousness, the power of you know, collective positive intentions. So I think there is something that we can do. So doing the work ourselves, releasing whatever emotions we are feeling around what is going on, and then sending out a really pure light. And if that's something you can do yourself, fantastic. But if it's not something you can do yourself, I really urge you to reach out to somebody who can work with you to do this and to help you get through this, to process this and to release it. Because it matters. It matters to everybody. And we all have a part to play in it. So I'm really urging you to try and just process and to release whatever it is you're holding on to. And then once you are kind of nice and clear, then sending out your love, sending out your peace, this positive bright light, because the light is more powerful than the darkness. And the stronger we supercharge or turbocharge our light, the better it's going to be. So thank you for listening.